Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dak and today we're playing some more Orban. So last episode, we moved the remnants of the old base into the new base. Obviously, we've got a line of tethers going into the mine where we've got the uh, the auto drills, and we did unlock ourselves some new tools, which requires level two. Oh, have I then got to upgrade this on top of that? Well, bogger. Right, in that case, then, we need 40 of these. It's weird being middle mass button. Because we need to turn them into cogs. I also need some gold. I've only just got enough, right? Deposit valuables for your inventory into this storage. Transfer all contents to other storage units. Where did that just put all my gold? Has it got into one of my chests? Because it's not in my inventory. Oh, it's all in the vault still. Um, how much of this did I need? 20, right? And throw that in there. You can get smelting all of uh, that up. In fact, do we want to get doing more? I kind of like the idea of doing another um, three of the miners. So I'm going to need another 15 cogs. Just give me half. 15. Oh, now that's going to be 30 ingots. And I need another fifteen dollar. Farewell, my friend. My have that and have that. You keep doing what you're doing. Just gonna come across here and grab out a load of our ingots that we got cooking up last episode. I really need to remember to press E. Does copper take longer to smelt than iron? I might as well just keep these ingots on me, hadn't I? Yeah. Um, I don't think there's any point in staking the coal orcs. The first uh, node that we're going to get to is going to be the coal one. Right, I've got more than enough cogs to do what I need to do. So we might as well go and do that while he's crafting the rest of the cogs. It feels like later on we're going to need multiple of these workbenches. Like a couple of blacksmiths. I still need to kill a few more boars as well, so keep your eyes out. And we'll get that bigger backpack. Not that backpack space has been a problem at the minute, but having another row can't hurt. I assume later on as we get further into it and we start getting more and more resources coming in quicker, uh, the inventory will fill up relatively fast. Oh. I just need somebody to agree with me. Just get him to jump. As I say something. Right. You give me this and have one of them. Toggle on. Beauty. This one's probably switched off by now. Yes, it has. Just chuck all of that in there. Toggle that one on. Chuck all of that in there. Toggle that one on. And just like that, we've doubled the amount of resources we've got coming in. I should really find one of the stone ones close to the surface as well, shouldn't I? Uh, give me that. Half of that, half of that. I'm pretty sure somebody's trying to stab me in the back here. I told you. God damn little boggers. Yeah, this is this is the easiest spot that we've found so far. Again, we'll we'll get exploring further into it later on. We just don't want to at the minute. Why is that over there? It's not that far from where we are. Yep. 
That's another copper deposit. And another copper deposit. Yup. We're set on copper. Good God. Oh. I have killed one of them before. I just don't want to try and take one on now. It was when I was doing my trial. Before I started recording the series. Raven had told me about these orcs that one shot you. And to avoid them. So of course I had to go and find one. And just see what I could do against one. If you keep running past them and just taking one swing at a time and keep running in the same direction, they don't tend to be able to hit you. So I have already got the achievement for killing one of them amusingly. Just need a few more boar hides, I think. You've got that nice line of tethers leading back to your base and you still managed to get lost. Good job, team. Eventually, I'd like to have an elevator in our base just going down into a tunnel somewhere and we'll branch out from there i don't know if that's a good idea like strip mining almost so if you block as soon as you hit them ooh, does that mean i've got no that actually gave me four hide from that one cool oh you should have our cogs that we need now and then you should be able to get upgraded my god, it's so freaking loud. Mace, barrel bomb, blow up your enemies. Backpack 2, expand your inventory slot by 10. We do... We don't need the smaller backpack. Okay, we'll just skip that one then. Admittedly, I've not got 30 hide, but we can keep saving up. This can all go in there. Um, iron ore. I shouldn't have thrown all of that into that one, but it'll be fine. Uh, there's a big ogre outside with the sounds of it. That's, that's not really the one. That's not what we want. Have I got to go talk to him? Can I not just... Contents to your inventory. Deposit valuables for you, from your inventory into that. Right. Let's get making some of this stuff then. So, iron pickaxe is wood and iron ingots. That is wood and iron ingots. That is wood and iron ingots. I guess we need some wood and iron ingots. don't know what he's attacking. Craft one of them. Craft one of them. Craft one of them. And then we can go iron pickaxe there. Iron axe there. Guess iron axe there. Shovel there. And mace. These can just go in this chest for now. Out of the way. I do need to go and check to see what he's smashing. Because I'd rather him not smash everything. I've only just built my base. I can do without you destroying it already. He's just smashing on my foundations. That is just rude. This actually feels like it blocks better now as well. I don't know if there's a repair tool either. You know, to fix some of these things up. Right, should we see if we've got any quests ticked off by me doing this? Interact. So, completed, 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 completed. I still need to build a bed. And I've technically already completed this one. Oh, I've got to get a hundred coal ore to finish it off. Okay. What do we need for a bed? Wooden boar hide. And one, two, three, four, five. Uh, furniture, bed. Oh, is this going to have a nice light on it? 
Oh, it's ten wood, idiot. Set spawn. We'll have a nice red bed. That's cool that it puts a light on when your spawn point saved them. Right, so that should be a quest ticked off. I just need to go and get the coal from here now, and then we can tick this one off, and then we've done the beginning. We still need to go find more boars. You know, now that I've got a mace, maybe we can one-shot them. The floating ore patch is back. We'll go and test the pickaxe out on that, I think. If anything, I don't need to keep grabbing wood at the minute. We've got plenty of wood for now. Right, have I physically got to have 100 coal in my inventory when I click on the uh, the quest thing? Or can I just pick up over 100 ore and then we're good? I'm hoping I get more than 100 out of these. You know, when i finished topping everything off and whatnot. Yeah, we, we need these being automated and brought back up. Me having to come down here to get these is just not fun. Pop that one off. Oh, helps if we toggle them back on. Will we need more than two per ore? I mean, if we get more than two per ore, it does scale up quicker, but... I can see you over there. You're not as discreet as you uh, might believe. I didn't even turn that one on. That's upsetting. Fine. I two shot them now. That is amazing. It will be a bit of back and forth early on in this game, it feels like. I wonder if we can dig straight down and hit one of these tunnels from our base. I want to have a room. Maybe... Not the room that we've started in. Maybe if we go like straight through and back one more room, we can have an elevator room. Admitted, I don't know how close we are to elevators, but... You know what, while we're out here, should we have a quick look around for some balls? I'd really like to get that medium backpack. Oh, we one-shot them now, so I've not got to even worry about blocking after I attack. Um, I should probably grab some mushrooms as well, and stone, I guess. Any more balls? You know, normally while I'm just around the base, there's hundreds of them. I didn't realise there was this crater right behind my uh, new base. Hi. Bye. Let's test this out, shall we? Is there multiple deposits here? Is this faster? It's not doing any more damage. I just heard something walk up to my left. I'm pretty sure there's a boar watching me do this. Stop coming back. Oh, killed him without taking any damage. Get ranked. Is it going to be one of them games where slowly over time more and more enemies are going to start just rushing my base or rushing me to try and kill me? Because then we're going to have to get some defences. There's no uh, two ways about it. I mean, I plan on getting some defences anyway, like, but... <clears throat> you know what I'd like to do, actually? I'd like to flatten this terrain and have some foundations lower. And then have an outer defense and an outer wall out here. But that's that's quite a ways away yet. Don't worry about it. Or maybe I can just expand this out and have a wall there somewhere anyway. Um, right. We can complete that one as well. Complete the beginning se section. Hi. And then what we've got for mining. Mine and get some more Mighty Dwarf. Dig anywhere and go deeper, explore caves and tunnels to get some. 
Oh, I only need 20 ruby ore, and I can uh, take that one off. The potions are a little bit more difficult to do. Iron tools. I've not got any large ones yet, have I? Mini turrets. I'm up to two grand now. Was it all from inventory? Nice. Um, just eat that and eat that. Is it worth me doing any research? Um, iron ore, top that off. Just keep them going. And that can go in there. We're actually doing pretty alright on coal at the minute. What have I got 10 extra cogs for? Did I mess that up? I mean, evidently I did. Mushrooms go in there. Orc skulls go in there. <coughs> right, didn't I need iron tools for one of these quests? Why do you guys keep spawning? Oh, okay. Um, I need 200 iron tools. It's, when you hover over it, it's a 0 out of 50. Sorry, what? Let's start off by making 50 iron tools then, shall we? Um, that's going to need 100 iron ingots. And 50 gold. I think that's 100 iron ingots right there. That's 95. So close. I don't want to just sell the copper. I want to save it for now and see if we can do anything better with it. Uh, give me $50. How can I help you? $50, thank you. And iron tools. <clears throat> So let's see if this is actually 200 or if we need, just need the 50. I mean, I'm not going to stand here and watch it. We're going to go out and hunt some more boar. I think I need to go to a different grassy area. Or just further out of this grassy area. We seem to have uh, depl uh, depleted the uh, the boar population around here. Never know, some Urwagas might come for me. Maybe we could try taking on the bigger ones now that I've got a decent weapon. I say decent. It's just not the starter weapon anymore. Earth shards. Like, do, do, do balls even respawn or anything? Or... I won't be grabbing stuff. we're running about we might as well be grabbing stuff I'm gonna need loads of stone anyway to expand the base later down the line admittedly we can get miners on them later on when we find them but any more boars out this way I don't even know how much shirt leather we need at this point If this is soft stone, I assume there's going to be other stone later on. Thank you. Ice crystals, mushrooms. 
It's alright, we've got the compass to get back. Don't don't panic too much that I'm just running off in all random directions. We could always try and get some more ruby ore as well, take another one of them quests off. Either there are very few boars spawn in this game, or I'm just blind and keep running past them. The second one is more likely. Right then. Oh, copper deposit. Yeah, boy, 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 boy. Isn't there farming though? Can't you breed animals in this game? Or grow animals. Maybe that's just a better way to get leather if you can. But we've not even researched into that yet. We've not got cash coming in quick enough. I think we need to focus on the one thing at the minute. And um, that's automating the mines, in my opinion. Once we've got that just flowing in, then we can start working on other stuff. A ball. Ooh, ruby ore. Right near the surface. Guy. Was that really worth doing? He had to get that last hit in, didn't he? I can block it. I just need to stop being an idiot. And just... The method is just keep swinging at this point. Um, yeah, we've got more than 20 ruby ore at this point. I'll do for a minute. I'll say, where did that freaking ball go? It's nice when they give you five hide or six hide per kill. That's one of the flowers we need for the stew. There's another boar. I did take a little bit of a beat in there. Now there's another boar across that side. You weren't there a minute ago. The ragdoll on the bodies is brilliant. Come here. Normally the balls all run at me, not away from me. Right, where are we going? That way. I'm not actually that far from base. I thought we were further away than that. Not that that's a problem, like, but... Um, this chasm's a slight problem. Autosave. You can d turn up or down the frequency of autosave. I've currently got it set to every 15 minutes, just because that's what it is by default. It doesn't bother me that it freezes my game for a second. It's fine. Oh, look, there's more balls across there now. They look like they'd hurt you if you walked through them. We're in some sort of jungly area. Just looking for a way across this chasm. Stumbled upon another ball. I don't think that's going to take me across. I think that's going to lead to a floating island in the middle. We'll have a quick look, though, because it looks relatively cool. I, I bloody knew it. And it's way too high for me to jump down from up here. Uh, high. I think this is one of the only games where jumping doesn't cost stamina. Have I got any food on me? Just eat all of them. Oh, I've got a gold ingot on me. Nice. Right, we might need to have picked up some wood to have built a bridge across here. So this is just daft. I 
I'm starting to wonder if I can fall down here uh, and not die. It looks like if I'd have just gone around that way, it would have... That's my base right there, isn't it? Why did I come this way around? Or did I come around that way? I don't bloody know. Don't bloody know. Alright, home sweet home. <clears throat> we got back to three grand quickly though, didn't we? I guess ticking off them quests nice and fast does help out. I'm not bothered about getting this edge square anymore. I tried to do it off camera for a little while. Just wasn't working. Oh, hi. Oh, bye. Surely I've got enough. I've got 30 on me right now. And bigger backpack. Oh, I've not got enough inventory space. Wow. Need more inventory space to craft more inventory space. And... Oh, look at that. Beauty. Um, silver ingot can go in there. Gold ingot can go in there. We've got so many freaking boar carcasses, it's not even funny. Wood, skulls, crystals, crystals, that, that, that. Got some of them plants, them mushrooms, and just a million boar carcasses. Keep them on me, keep the mushroom soup on me. Posit everything. Oh, yes. Tools. One second. I have 50 iron tools. So we do, in fact, need 200. <clears throat> so you are going to need way more. Like, way, way more. Like, we're going to need 400 ingots, aren't we? Uh, well, actually, we're going to need 300 more, but same difference. You know what? I know I said I wasn't going to sell them, but let's have a look what we can get. Oh, and we're just loaded now. I can't cook anything fun in this yet, can I? Mm, not really. That's 20,000. I don't know what the difference the picks did, though, so I'm not that bothered about that. Gemstone detection. Farming. Oh, that's where you get the spit roast from. Elevators and then there's rails. Copper plates, iron plates. Copper pipe work, iron cogs. That all seems dead freaking expensive. What's all this? Normal bat. Ooh! They take an iron ingot to make a normal belt. Boils water using coal or wood requires water. Pumps water and burns. I've not seen um, water anywhere. Allows belts to be attached to auto crush powder. It melts powder into ingots. Container that allows material input and output with belts. What? Splitters? Mergers? What are we going? Do we go into automation three? Automated market automatically sells items with four bell inputs. Wow. Uh, 
basic traps. Spike trap, small arrow trap, large arrow trap, mini turret. It kind of feels like we need to go into this. Oh, I need 25 iron plates and 25 iron cogs as well. Um, right, I guess we'll wrap this episode up here. I'm just going to do a few more trips between here and the mines to go and get some more uh, stuff for smelting. Because we're clearly going to need loads more stuff, aren't we? So that is where we're going to leave it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated, as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers!